Oh my god, have I got the most exciting news! You have never been so pumped for an iPhone video today. In fact, not just iPhone video, this is going to be the most exciting tech video of all time. Absolutely no doubt, absolutely no clickbait. This is so much reason to get excited, okay? So we've all been hearing about the iPhone X, right? Or the 10 or whatever you want to call it. Now it's official that it's a real phone. There's actually leaked pictures that someone else took in public of someone using it. We got these leaked photos here. This is exclusive. This is only available. Available from Taylosiv. Didn't grab these anywhere else, okay? You can only find these pictures on Taylosiv Tech. That's why you're subscribed to What's me. What's amazing about these pictures is it proves that the iPhone that Apple announced at their keynote is in fact an iPhone that exists in the real world. You no, know, it wasn't just some fake CG stuff that Craig was showing. Craig actually had a working iPhone 10, and now these pictures are proving that the iPhone 10 does in fact exist. Now, that's not all. It's already pretty cool that Apple employees, you know, people that work at Apple, are able to use iPhones that have not come out yet because, you know, they may make them there. So that's really exciting, but also, you just got this 100% confirmed information from Foxconn itself. Then you guesskin's a personal friend of mine, we talk all the time. Like, I'll be at his wedding, he just got engaged, it's gonna be awesome by the way. He's gonna put his activity rings on her marriage ring. A joke somewhere in there. Foxconn is now shipping completed iPhone 10 models to the United States. It's already rumored that there's like 40 to 50,000 in this first shipment. And we believe that they're using aircraft to ship them overseas, because if you didn't know, here's a chart here so you have a better understanding of it. China is actually far away from the United States. These countries have an ocean separating them. So it's rumored, and this is leaked, this is 100% exclusive confirmed, Foxconn is using an airplane to therefore transport said iPhone 10 to Apple in the United States, which is going to put all of these iPhone 10s that apparently Foxconn is building. Did you hear about that? Foxconn built them. Those iPhones are going to be put in the Apple stores that are within the United States, which will be available, as Apple said, a month ago on November 3rd. So this proves, once again, my leaked information point from Apple, that indeed, on November 3rd, when Apple said they would be available, they will, in fact, indeed be available. And now, that's not all, everyone. There's more. If that wasn't exciting enough, oh my god. You might want to pause the video and watch some like cool relaxing river music or something. Which is just like 10 hour loops of like a river creek trickling down. Just to calm down because this next bit of information is going to shock you. You are going to blow your literal mind. In fact, you might want to hold your eyeballs like this because if you're watching this video and you're not prepared for this top secret information that is exclusive to Talos of Tech, your eyeballs might literally jump out of your skull. You need to be ready for this, okay? Make sure you're sitting down because if you're standing, you're gonna faint. No longer a question, you are going to faint right now. I myself, the Apple sheep of YouTube, have actually caught first-hand footage of Apple employees using the iPhone 10 in public. Once again, verifying that the iPhone 10 is a real phone. This is true. This is 100% fact. This is a leaked source. Venya Geskin doesn't even have this footage, which I'm about to play to you. Here we go. Take a look. So as you can see, if we slow that video down really quick, we actually see this user is probably scrolling or maybe he's texting or something, I don't know. He's probably not using the Animoji feature because his face is rather static, it's not moving much. But as you can see, on the back of this phone, the cameras are in fact vertical, therefore proving that this is an iPhone 10 being used in public. You cannot find this anywhere else. This is leaked footage, 100% correct, this is not clickbait, this is real, and I just can't believe it, guys. It's so exciting to find out that the iPhone 10 is in fact a smartphone phone which is coming out. Can't believe it. This is this is groundbreaking information. This is going to blow up my channel. We're about to pass Pootie Pie, I'm sure at this point. Most successful video ever. Okay, and that's not all. The leaks, they just keep coming at you today, okay? There's nothing but leaks and rumors and there's nothing but 100% exclusivity to Talos of Tech. The next rumor is that the iPhone 10 will reportedly be shipping in boxes. Just like these boxes, okay? They shipped the iPhone 10 in the same kind of box that the iPhone 8 came in, which is a questionable argument. You know, sometimes people thought they'd be in bags. Sometimes they think they'll be in boxes, and it's rumored that this year it will in fact be exactly the same as the past 10 years of iPhone releases. Stay in character. Okay. So, if that wasn't enough proof to you, because a lot of people are going to deny it, right? <laughs> Drew, how do you know they're shipping the iPhone 10 in boxes? Well, first of all, Apple leaked this themselves. If you go to the Apple Store app, or if you go to apple.com, you can 
see in the store a picture of a box with a picture of the iPhone 10 on it. Therefore proving that the iPhone 10 is being shipped in boxes. But I mean, honestly guys, like we've been talking about the iPhone 10 for the last 15 months. Who even cares anymore? The leaks for the 2018 iPhone are already coming out. These are of course 100% one, one, real. In 2018, we'll also be receiving three new iPhones. One's gonna be better than the iPhone 10 actually. But the same 5.8 inch display, but then there's going to be a massive 6.4 inch display. Might as well call this the iPad mini at this point and a six inch LCD one that we have no idea what it looks like. We're just guessing here, but this is indeed fact. There's no denying it. This is real. There will be three new iPhones coming out next year. It's rumored they'll have a ProMotion display. Perhaps we'll finally see that jump to 512 gigabytes. Oh my God, I'm so psyched. I know I fill up my 256 one just like that. It, it happens immediately. These also could feature smaller notches or even thinner bezels than before. A lot of people were saying, you know, they're not gonna include Touch ID underneath the display this year, but that's actually wrong. In fact, the entire display will be a Touch ID sensor and the entire back and the camera lenses. You can put your finger on the camera lenses and we'll it will use the 4K camera to read your fingerprint and therefore unlock and the bumpers on the side. The entire phone is a fingerprint reader. Even if you break it open and put your fingers on the circuit board parts, it will actually act as a fingerprint reader. They're putting fingerprint readers everywhere. In fact, the headphone jack is also coming back. Screw it, why not? Also, the 2018 iPhones are rumored to actually cure cancer. This is 100% real. They will do it. They can transform into jetpacks and actually allow you to fly. They're making huge enhancements to airplane mode. So guys, I don't know about you, but I'm pretty psyched. There's definitely reason to be excited. However, Samsung is working on all these features about five months before the next year's iPhones will come out. Whether they're called the 10 II or the 11 or the 2018 iPhone, or the Apple phone or the phone pod or the iPhone spelled E-Y-E -E pod. We still have no idea. There's so many leaks. There's so many rumors, but I'm 100% certain everything I said today was correct. Haters will say it's fake. And anyone who denies all these facts today hates science. Okay, that was obviously parody. What was the point of this? It was to let you guys know that I think hype for the iPhone 10, despite it being out, is still incredibly, incredibly high. And I thought that maybe if Apple announced it, it wouldn't be as exciting anymore. But clearly because we're still posting articles about the fact that when they're done making iPhones, they ship them to the US. That's still publishing. Like that happens every single year, guys. With every single Apple product that's made in China, they ship them out after they're done making them. And people are excited about that. I'm excited for it too. I'm really looking forward to buying one. I'll be getting one. But don't expect it to change your life. There's no need to get this hype so, so, so high because you're still gonna use it mostly for texting, scrolling through Twitter, watching YouTube videos. And it'll do a good job at that. And the display is nice, but you're going to get used to it in about five minutes. And you'll be waiting all year for the next iPhone, which will have months and months and months of buildup. And then eventually it'll happen and you'll be like, oh, okay, here it is again. So please don't get your hype unnecessarily high as demonstrated by me in this video to show you that I feel like we get super, super excited about nothing nowadays. So let's just chill. It's a good phone. It'll be a nice upgrade. But just because there's another human being using one doesn't mean we need to go crazy, all right? This is your Apple Sheep here, and I will see you in the next one.